Happy Monday, my fellow strangers. It's Mrs. Strange here again. On today's episode for Stranger Universe, I will talk about Winona Ryder's new interview for Stranger Things 4. Before we start, please like, share, and subscribe to see more episodes from Stranger Universe. Please turn on your notifications to attend video premieres and get a chance to interact with Mrs. Strange and other Stranger fans. Help get this episode to 1000 views and likes if you really want to see us release more Stranger Universe episodes like this one. Please don't forget to share this video across all social media platforms to help fans and viewers join our Strange family and find this great Stranger Universe content. And now, let us begin. Yesterday, Stranger Things creators Matt and Ross Duffer attended Deadline's Contenders television event with Winona Ryder. Last night, we went over the details that the Duffers shared on the panel in our most recent video, including the fact that every episode is over an hour and that the show will start answering questions that viewers had since season 1. When asked about her role in Stranger Things 4, Winona Ryder made sure not to reveal too many details, but she revealed that Joyce will be adjusting to her new life as well as being a mother for Eleven, which will definitely be enticing to see on screen. Um, I think that, you know, we, she's sort of grieving, you meet, you know, we, she's trying to move on, she's got, she's got her new daughter, she's the, the new mom in town, she doesn't really have any friends, she's, you just meet her and she's like, sort of that Joyce thing, just trying to do the best she can probably making mistakes she's just very human mm -hmm. in that way and um and then things go crazy right like i i don't know i know we can't get get into it really but things, i think things i think we'd be yeah pretty crazy and i think her, we'd be disappointed her, if they didn't right I mean, it's the a strange part thing. of her brain that gets to choose what to focus on is sort of shattered like it's it's survival right right and and survive not just per, you know per, personal survival but survival for her loved ones yeah. it definitely sounds like we will be seeing the new family in town type of approach with the buyers in this season similar to how max and billy were treated in the second season as being the new people in hawkins one has to wonder if joyce will be working at a very different type of job in this new californian town as for her storyline, it seems pretty obvious that she will fly to Russia with Murray to rescue Hopper. The big question, though, is how she leaves and what causes her to leave her kids behind. It makes me wonder if the big shootout at her house separates her away from her kids and causes both groups to split up from there. The Duffers also acknowledged that the 80s timeline of the series was creeping up on the real-world ascendants of Winona Ryder as a major movie star. Her next film in the chronological flow would be Beetlejuice, a pop culture sensation that the show's kids would most certainly buy tickets for. Once we have, that's the threshold, we can't cross it, which is once Winona is a superstar in the world, like we can't, the show has to stop, I think. Because <laughs> then it'll, it'll like spontaneously combust or something, I don't know. That, that's, very... final, that, that's the final scene, the kids go to see Beetlejuice, their heads ex <laughs> explode. Now depending on how serious that talk is, it looks like season 5 might not have that big of a time jump. Beetlejuice came out on March 30th, 1988, so if we take his comment seriously, the Stranger Things franchise won't reach that year in the timeline. It has me a bit worried that they won't take into consideration the aging of the main characters, especially if season 5 actually picks up right after the events of season 4. Are we going to see a 16-year-old Priya Ferguson playing a 10-year-old Erica? That will be the strangest thing that will happen in Season 5. Hopefully it's just a funny side comment by the Duffers since they could just not reference Beetlejuice if they ever time skip past 1988. Overall, very exciting times. And that is all that we have for today. What did you think about what Winona Ryder had to say in regards to Stranger Things 4? Today's special shout-out is for Frictions. Comment down below to become our next special Stranger Universe shout-out. And don't forget to follow us at It's Stranaverse on Twitter and Instagram to stay updated with us every day. Click on our Discord link down in the video description or the comments section below to join the official Stranger Universe Discord server. Also, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Stranger Universe. Please turn on notifications to never miss another Stranger Universe episode again. 
help get this video to 1000 views and likes if you really want to see us release more Stranger Universe episodes like this one. Don't forget to share this video across all social media platforms to help fans and viewers join our strange family and find this great Stranger Universe content. This episode was brought to you by Mrs. Strange, and this is Stranger Universe.